What's up guys? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. So what we're doing today is we are testing out two makeup looks. Two past two possible birthday makeup looks. So that's why I did my face off camera and everything. So we get in straight to it. I'm gonna show you guys the uh, two makeup look references. This is one. That's one, but I feel like, I don't know, it's more like every day with the brown, but I do like the wing, so I'm going to see if I could like use the wing and the other look, because I think the other look looks more like glam birthday look. And this is the second one. It's more fancy, but like minus the pink waterline and adding a wing. I think that would look cute. But I'm going to try it like, come on. But I'm going to try it how it is and see how it looks. And then, you know, I'll just add the wing. And if I don't like it, I'll just know that to not put the wing. But yes, we bought our start. I'm excited. We're using the Jaclyn Hill palette because they got a lot of neutral shades in here. We're going to start with the simple side. We're going to start with the brown eyeshadow and then the wing one. So I'm going to put some concealer on my lid. All right putting a little bit because I don't want that much concealer blended up. We're just putting it on the lid. You're really supposed to be patting it for it to be more concealed, but I want it like a light conceal so I can rub it. So, let me see the picture one more time. Okay, it's brown. Not that dark of a brown, so I'm thinking this one. Yeah, let's try this one see how it looks. Okay, I tapped into it twice. Now, this is going all over the lid, so you see, you can barely see that. So I'm going to get some more. This brush is so soft. It's so satisfying. Okay, I need to deepen it. So it's just mad light. I'm going to try this brown. It looks darker than it is, so I'm going to try to go lightly though. Okay, I tapped into it once. So, okay, this is what it is. Yup, 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 yup. I'm slowly blending towards the outer corner because this, you can't mess this up because this is a one shade eyeshadow look with a wing. I'm gonna dip into it one more time. Bring it more towards the inner front. Let's dust it. I wanna wipe as much as I can off because I just, well, I could use a clean brush. Which I should, but um, let's just see. Last thing, and I'm gonna blend out the edges. <sighs> now to the good part. I'm not really good with the wing. Well, I did it like twice. It was alright, but like comfortable enough to like do it on a regular. No. But so I got a cream liner this time instead of the liquid because the liquid is hard. It's not beginner friendly at all. I got a cream one. I heard it's easy um, to work with. So we're going to see. I'm going to show you. I got it from the beauty supply. So. Ew. Come on. Got it. Hopefully this is good. Let's see how black it is. Oh, that's black. I think it said it was waterproof too. And it's already at a point. You know, it's not like the round. It's like pointed. I'm excited already. Okay, she kind of has a short wing, but it's kind of thick a little bit and she's thin in the front She brung it all the way like a cat eye, but I'm scared if I mess it up I don't know if you could hear Luna, but she being loud Okay, I did it in the front. I don't know if that was retarded This is not something you can rush, so I don't know. I'm not planning to be rushing on my birthday, but... <sighs> okay, now we're gonna clean it up. Put a little bit of concealer on here. I'm going to make it sharp. I don't really wanna fix it. 
I'm taking that liner brush in that brown and I'm gonna go over here with it because I made it white with the conceal. Now I'm gonna try to sharpen it. It's hard to sharpen it because it's round, so rub some of this on here. You know, this might be the key. She did do the bottom though. But I'm scared if I mess it up. <laughs> The roundness is just not gonna work. I dipped into some black right here. I'm gonna blend some brown. You're scared of the deers? Huh? You're scared of the deers? Yes! Oh my help! I can't go in the car. Go run. I said I'm recording. You're gonna have a debut. I'm gonna be in a video. Mhm. Mm no. I can't mute this. I'm gonna be talking. I don't Yo, know. I look like a witch. But the wing is really good. You do not look like a witch. You look gorgeous. You look gorgeous. Gorgeous. Is this a birthday look? I like it, but then I'm like, do I really want to have to do struggle in the morning? You know, when it's always the day of doing something, it's always never wants to work. Like, I'll be really mad. Second look, same thing, not too high. So for the next look, I'm going to start with that first light brown we did. And then we're going to deepen it a little bit with the dark brown. So we're gonna see how those two first colors look. So I'm going in circular motions. You can barely see it because it's just like very light. So I'm gonna tap into it twice, but I'm not gonna dust it because I want it to be as much on it as possible. Okay, it is really too light. So I'm gonna need another brown. Um, so I want a dark, deeper brown, but I don't want that dark brown yet. I need like a good brown. So I'm trying this Avani palette. And what, what shade is this? And Phony? And Phony. What? I think your car is fast? It's not. So, um, it's And Phony. My face is getting so oily already, but I'm gonna, um, put powder. We're gonna deepen with that dark shade right here. So we're deepening right in the crease. You see where your eye lens across the crease? Right here. And I'm slowly dragging it down here. Bruh. <laughs> okay, I'm dragging it towards here. Hers is more brown, so I'm trying the Nikki palette. We are on palette three right now, trying to find this brown. So you see she has this nice looking brown. And then we're gonna blend around this. We dip it into that brown again. We're gonna go around here. Basically almost on that first shade that I put. Cause I just need this to get more brown around the edges, like here. We're trying to lighten it even more because hers is really light around here. Okay, now we're gonna go back in. It's not the same shade she used, so I'm going to use a little bit of that light brown we had. The first light brown color we had. Y'all yeah, probably gonna mix up. This one's a little too deep for the picture that I'm trying to do. So I'm gonna dip into this lighter one and we're gonna see if that will lighten it a little bit. So I'm packing that on top of here. She has like that nice mixed caramel looking. Right over and get a nice mix between those two shades. Taking some concealer. I'm gonna put a tail. I am not used to doing cut concealer. I'm here. It does not follow the natural. Okay, 
Okay, now I'm going to pat it in so it's not so wet. It's not that sharp, but we're gonna fix it. The color is um kind of light gold color, so I'm trying to see. All right, we're gonna try to test out the glitters. So I was looking at this one. And it's type white, it's like an icy tone. We need warm tone, and then there's this gold. It looks nice. Okay, I wrapped it once. Maybe it was supposed to be higher here. You can't see it when I look straight. I think it just looks weird without being higher. I'm gonna pat it so it's not liquidy. We're going into the Avani brown that we use. And we're going to pat it right here. She did like it faded out right here. Then we're gonna use some of that lighter brown from the um, Jaclyn Hill one. Blend a little bit of that here. Then we are going to get, lastly, that deep brown from the Jacqueline palette. And we're going to pat that here. This is a little bit too brown now here. So I'm going to pat into a little bit of this light shade and put that over this brown a little bit in the front. But we could like dim it down. See, it's not as brown now. Okay. Then dust this one off because hers is a little bit more brown on the outside. So I'm going back in that Amphony in the um, Avani palette, dusting it like three times. And I'm going to bring that more on top of here. Blend it like that. Then we're going to blend out what I just did because I kind of put too much. And then she did a brown at the bottom. So I think now if I like it. I don't know how I feel. Maybe if I would have did a regular crease, but I don't know. I'm gonna try a wing though on this eye. That does kind of look cool. And you see it's not as thick in the front like I did this one. I did it a little thinner. Now we're gonna clean it up with concealer and see. with that good brown and that we blend it off the edges then we are using this pointy liner and getting some and make it short this brush is amazing making it real sharp i'm thinking should i try this waterline that she did we're gonna try it right here in the Vani palette. This is a darker pink. This kind of looks red. So what we're going to do is there's a pink in here. We're going to try to save it. We're going to try to put some of this on top because this is not the right pink in the picture. So the under eye, she has that brown. So we're going to dip it into the Anfoni in the Avani. And we're going to do She has a little deeper, so we're gonna try this brown from the Nikki Tutorials one. 5 a.m. Let's see, we don't want too much. Then we're going to dip into Anfony one more time and um, blend out this one. All right, we're gonna put some mascara. using the fence 
Pepsi Bomb. This is in shade Diamond. Wait. This is in shade Cognac. Cognac Candy. gonna do the nose and top it a bit now I'm gonna do the lip we're gonna do the brown lip they both got the brown lip but one's a little less so we're gonna see This is the final look. Let me know what you think. I'm trying to go close this one. Let me know which one you guys like, which one you guys pick. I don't know how I feel. Like I like this one, and I kind of like this one. Maybe if I lowered it, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I am confused. Thanks for watching, guys. I need you guys help i don't know which one and i'm like i need to know in four days so thanks for watching i hope you liked and um maybe learned something like a technique or like something i don't know maybe with the wing like using a smaller brush that's what i would say like a thin brush i hope you guys enjoyed and like comment subscribe don't forget to put your notification bell on so you're updated whenever i post and yes i like that it's only with the nails i like that but all right i'll see you guys in my next video bye